Welcome to Archway Devlog number 9. Um, it's been about 40 or 50 days since the last one, um, and maybe even longer since the last update. Um, but this one, uh, this devlog is coming up just on the cusp of the actual update, which will be released uh, just in a few days um, of this video. Um, we redid a lot of the item systems, a lot of the core mechanics, as well as the, uh, the way monsters are handled. Um, but mainly this update will focus on um, a lot of tweaks. It has the new paper dolling system. Um, it has the new ability system. Um, so when this update rolls out, there should be um, there should be about five to six um, unique abilities for each class. Um, there's gonna be a new player chat, um, as well as a new paper doll system that we're, we're really excited for, um, as well as player customization. So just to showcase a little bit of it, um, there's a little bit of the characterization here. You can kind of change everything up. Eventually we'll add in like a like a random button, um, but for now you'll just be able to choose. We also changed the way all the players look. Um, as you can tell, um, we kind of more went for the paper dulling look. So that's everything is just kind of layered um, and that allows us to do cool things, for example, before when you wore items you didn't really get to see it now you actually get to see everything so when you equip like a pickaxe or a hatchet and you're cutting down trees um, everyone around you will be able to see what gear you have um, some quick things we changed um, before every five levels there was a new gear set for an example uh, copper is level five um, then iron at level 10 for all the heavy heavy armor and um, iron items um, so we kind of added a buffer zone. So copper will now be randomly between five and nine. Um, so pretty much a buffer of four levels. So what that means is um, instead of getting all level five gear and you're kind of just grinding to level 10 without any ever new gear other than rarity, um, you can now grind for gear um, at different levels. So you, you always have the opportunity to get better gear um, and especially better rarities. Um, just to showcase a little bit of the ability system, um, just for now I only added into three just for this video, uh, Snipe, Haste, and Pierce. Um, so all of these, just like items, get all added in here, added onto the hotbar. Uh, we have a global cooldown, so if we eat an apple, there's a cooldown, you can't just keep eating. Um, obviously in the future with some feedback um, and just kind of balancing, we'll need to figure out um, the cooldowns, mana costs, and damage. Uh, so that's kind of why we really, really hope we get some feedback. Um, and just to showcase some quick abilities, I'll spawn in an archer. So first one is haste. Um, I just realized uh, I don't actually have the level. So this is a cool thing about the chat. We redid the chat too. It kind of separates it, so as you can see, you don't have the level required to use the ability. Even though they're all different levels, so I just got to quickly switch to my other character. Well, let's go ahead and do the same thing. So the haste. As you can see, it increases your movement speed, um, and you can also see that reflecting in here. Um, so all of the abilities has a main attribute type. So for example, all of these ones are agility. Um, so the higher your agility level, as well as the spell power and attack power, depending on which class and which spell, um, it'll reflect that. Um, so for example, for the, the haste, it went back down, but uh, for this spell, it's reflected by agility. The base happens to be um, 20, but it gave about 28. Um, so getting the appropriate attributes is, is, is extremely important, especially since you can customize so many of them. Um, everything down here has a cooldown, so we can go ahead and use a, a bleed. Um, so a lot of the a lot of these abilities are are kind of unique. Um, and I just, once again, they all need to be balanced and tested as they're not really perfect from the start. Um, and I guess I'll take quite a few run fruits just to kind of get them perfect. Um, I guess that kind of concludes this devlog. So make sure you 
you like and follow and kind of share this around. We don't really have any like, advertisement or anything like that. So a lot of our, uh, I, I guess I would say like views comes from just kind of word of mouth. So just make sure you kind of spread around just so you can see the progress um, as well as upcoming uh, updates we have for you guys.